What do you want after your shot? Candy. Okay. Come in. Okay. I'm going to be your doctor today, and my name is Dr. Hudson. Vanessa here is at the doctor's office to get a flu vaccine. So, what's your name? Vanessa. What were you born? April 16th, 2005. And how are you? Good. Um, any questions before the shot? Uh, I was wondering if it was going to hurt. No, it's not going to hurt. It's just going to be a little pinch. Okay. Um, you can distract her by making her look this way, by holding her hand. Mm -hmm. But don't give her hug because that's going to make her arm hurt more. Which makes sense. Okay. Um, can you stick out your tongue, please? Okay. See, don't You're to hold my hand. I know, I'm going to shot. Good boy. There? No. You're big girl now. So can you sign right here, please? Hi, we're Malia Jazan. We're in seventh grade, and today we're going to talk to you about the issue of child abuse. These are all children who have suffered from being abused. It has gotten so bad that five children a day die from child abuse. Seventy percent of children being abused are under the age of three. One of three girls and one of five boys were sexually abused before the age of eighteen. 2.9 million cases of child abuse are reported in the United States. This, this needs to stop now. For example, a four-year-old girl named Tegan was terrorized for 10 days by highly shed by her mother's boyfriend while her mom was in training. This all happened with no one knowing.
I don't okay. care. Give me her. Eighty percent of children in Nigeria gets abused emotionally and physically. An average of six out of ten children gets abused before turning eighteen. One in ten kids were abused before they turned five. Nigerian kids have been abused in many ways, such as physical, sexual, and emotionally. Other people may be demons, but we can stop it. We can help. It blows my mind while people think refugees are not human. They've done nothing to harm us, and what do we do? Treat them unfairly. Some of us, some of them are just people trying to escape war, and when they come to the U.S., there's nothing but mistreatment. Then, it's not that different from their original home country. There's war in both places, and it can only be fixed with this argument. Refugees were displaced in 2011 from their home country and given no permission to be brought back. There were approximately about 2.6.4 million people who were taken out and placed somewhere else. The sad thing is, is that 50% of refugees are under the age of 18. IDP stands for Internally Displaced People. People have been taken out of their home and placed somewhere else. In 2012, the Middle East and North Africa had the most IDP which is about 2.6 million people who were displaced. It's time we take action for our brothers and sisters who can't take action for themselves. We are here. We will stay. We will give our rights away. Refugees are here. Refugees are here. Refugees are here. Children are the future. 2.6 million Syrian children are living as refugees. 1.17 million Syrian children are not attending school. Almost 2.8 million children dropped out of school due to conflict and displacement. Only you can change the world. Only you can change the world. Be the change. Hey kid, we want three units of inhalers and school supplies. Tomorrow is our day for education. Don't cry kid, tomorrow is your big day. Okay, it's time for us to go. Bye. Education is tomorrow. With your help, this can be stopped.
Oh. How does it feel to open to the uh... You know, watching these people laugh and smile because of me, it just it makes me so happy and it brings a tear to my eye knowing that I have hope so many people. Help now. Volunteer for food security. People in Nigeria are dying due to war. One grain can stop me. The Burmese people kill the Rohingya because they do not like us. The Burmese light the house on fire on and kill the Rohingya people. They don't think we are human. We are human. We need your help. Please help us. We need chat and medicine. We need food and house and water. We need to be safe in life and we need to help our families. We are human. We, we are human. We are human. Can't you see, man? I just bought these stuff, man. Don't ask for money, man. Mm -hmm. No, please. No, give me. Give me. Give me. No. Please. What is UNHCR? The UNHCR stands for United Nations High 
Commissioner of Refugees. The UN has ensured that everyone has the right to seek asylum and find safe refugee in another state, with the option to eventually return home, integrate, and resettle. Boss, I need a job. Have a seat. Thank you. The UNHC help to generate income. This means getting job and making money. Boss, I need job. Why do you pick any job? To buy food and to eat, to protect their family, to pay beer and to rent. To buy clothes and start. I want to pay my house bill. Okay. Can I sign Shelter a home, a sleep place to eat and sleep. Why we need shelter? To protect, to protect from dangerous people, they can protect from earthquake, tornado, tsunami, or hurricane. All of the nature animal birds are big to raise their young and to survive, to eat, drink, and to sleep the same place. UNICEF ensuring gender equality. Gender equality means equal access to resources for girls, boys, and others. These resources include inclusion in education, player health, and vaccination. The students are talking about math homework with gender equality. Boys and girls can go to school together. Let us provide shelter for people to live. This baby can sleep. And they can and they can go to the bathroom. In a safe place. For 70 years across 190 countries and terrorism UNICEF defends the right of every child. Go. Why? To have fun. Why? To be happy. Let's go. Why? To feel. Why? Seeing other people happy make us happy. Okay. Why? Play is also good. Go. Go. Why? <laughs> to make friends. Why? To play together. Why? To learn other people's lives. We learn about World Food Program or WFP. The World Food Program helps over 80 million in 80 countries. They help with hunger and food security and help in emergency. They deliver food to communities to improve the nutrition. We need nutrition to keep our body healthy. Why? So we can go work? Why? To earn money? Why? To pay rent and to buy something to eat. Why? To survive! 
during times of displacement, the UNHCR provides critical emergency assistance in the form of clean water, sanitation, and healthcare, as well as shelter, blanket, household goods, and sometimes food. People need to leave their home to go somewhere. Why? <laughs> because there is war in the country. Why? Because people want to take their land and home. UNICEF defend the right of every share. UNICEF believe for every share. Deserve hydro and vaccine and safe clean water. Why do children need to go to the doctor and get shot? Because they need to be safe from this pain. They need to play and to be healthy. They need to go to school, do classwork, and learn new things.
around the world, 65.6 million people are forcibly displaced. 55% of refugees come from South Sudan, Syria, and Afghanistan. About 189,300 people currently have been resettled. Violence has been linked to forced displacement. The UN ACR is working to minimize the threat of violence. They want to help provide a safe environment for them with food and water. They help states establish asylum structures. They provide medical care for incoming refugees. Many of us wouldn't even be here today if it wasn't for them. Now tell, tell me, are you going to be part of the change? change?
$6 million was resourced to support emergency response for military partners in 2016. Around 21.5% of the population lives on less than $1.90 a day, and levels of inequality and social exclusion are very high. More than 450 local and international organizations supported with WFP World Food Program Humanitarian Services in 2016. 60% of refugees live in towns, cities, and other out of camp content. 50 special operations in April services such as logistics, augmentation, UNHAS, as well as support for the logistics, emergency telecommunications, and food security.